In March last year, we announced the awarding of 50 billion rand contract for the building of 1,064 diesel and electric locomotives. This is a majority portion of the locomotive acquisition program we have undertaken as part of the market demand strategy. The acquisition program will form the biggest rail recapitalization program in South Africa's history, with more than 1,300 locomotives being acquired. The award was to four global original equipment manufacturers, two North American manufacturers, and two Chinese manufacturers. We awarded to Bombardier Transportation and China South Rail Zuzu Electric Locomotive contracts to build 599 electric locomotives, and General Electric and China North Rail Rolling Stock to build 465 diesel locomotives. Transnet's market demand strategy is a program to invest in excess of 300 billion rand in capital expenditure over a seven-year period. Two-thirds of this CAPEX investment will be funded from revenue generated from operations, while a third will be borrowed from both the domestic and international capital markets. The capital expenditure will not be funded from the fiscus, and none of the borrowings will be guaranteed by the state. Today we are concluding a combined 13 billion rand funding raised in two agreements with various funders and financial institutions from Canada, the United States of America, and South Africa. The funding is specifically for the Bombardier and GE portions of the 1064 locomotive acquisition program. The first agreement is a 6 billion rand US Exim Bank funding guarantee for 293 locomotives to be built by General Electric. The funds in terms of the guarantee were raised from the following institutions. 2.25 billion from Bartley's APSA, 2.25 billion from Standard Bank, 1.5 billion from Old Mutual. The second agreement is a 6.99 billion loan facility for the funding of locomotives from Bombardier. The funds will be raised from the following institutions, 5.24 billion from the Export Development of Canada and 1.75 billion from Investec Bank Limited. The US Exim Bank backed loan is a 14-year facility and will be drawn over a three-year period in line with the delivery schedule for the locomotives. The Export Development Canada and Investec facility is a 13-year facility. We are encouraged by the vote of confidence that the institutions are showing in Transnet and in the Republic of South Africa. These agreements are proof of the attractiveness, commercial viability and bankability of Transnet capital programs. They confirm that we are on the right track, so to speak. Equally importantly, they are a massive thumbs up for South Africa's infrastructure build program and the National Development Plan.